Ladies Night Out 2. Stream it now only at TitleMatchNetwork.com. Diamonds Division Champion. She won that title at Ladies Night Out 1. Barbie Hayden has a loss in her record here at Reality of Wrestling. And that is an 0-1 record. Not a very good record going as a champion. Now let us start with this. Hai Young won that championship at the inaugural Ladies Night Out, defeating Kylie Ray, who we just saw moments ago. But in your mind, in her first defense of that championship here at Ladies Night Out, are there nerves, are there some jitters, despite the attitude, despite her presentation, does Hai Young have it all together to successfully defeat one of Texas professional wrestling's best female athletes in Barbie Hayden and successfully defend that title tonight, Brad? Well, you know, she did it against Kylie Ray, and we just saw Kylie Ray out here two times prior tonight. And she was a phenomenal athlete and a great professional wrestler, and Ha Young was able to capture that championship in the main event against someone the caliber of Kylie Ray. If she can do it there, she can do it here. She just has to remain focused and not let that bad attitude, if you will, get the best of her. We saw earlier, she. She and Barbie Hayden wanted to tear each other apart, much like Ha Young did to that quote unquote participation trophy. Oh! And for those of you who joined us later in the broadcast, just to recap the story of Ha Young as well, right after this pin attempt here, and a kick out at two. Now, there was a time where Ha Young was actually. Told to hit the road here at Reality of Wrestling, given the pink slip, if you will. Fired from the company. She thought her career was over. Now she's Diamond's di Diamond Division champion after defeating Kylie Ray. Well, a road to redemption for Hai Young. And she says and she claims she's done it without the Roe Nation. She doesn't need anyone's help or support. Well, that's what she claims, Matt Zapolsky, and so far she's proven it, but she got fired for, I think, the very same thing that's got her to the point she is. That's that bad attitude that we keep referencing. Booker T said, we don't need someone like you around here. We don't need any diamond in our division like you. But she went away. She practiced her craft. She got better, and she got another opportunity. And when she got that opportunity for Booker T again, she took advantage of it, and now she is the diamond. She is the one. She is the champion. She in the flagship of Texas wrestling, the reality of wrestling. Hai Young shoots underneath. Barbie oh. Hayden ducks to the outside. A bit of gamesmanship here from the challenger. Barbie Hayden can't win that title on the outside. She gets back into the ring. The mind games continue. Well, this is what I was talking about. Hai Young can't get frustrated. She can't let oh, oh. the veteran Barbie Hayden And let's state the obvious here, not bury the lead. Hai Young, of course, does have the champion's advantage. She could be counted out, and she will hang on to that Diamonds Division Championship. And as we know now, Jordan Grace waiting in the wings oh. after being declared number one contender tonight. Meanwhile, Barbie Hayden getting a steady diet of steel post. Well, Barbie Hayden wants to get this thing back inside the ring, and well, Hai Young puts it right there. Now, here we go, cover. One, two. Kick out from Barbie Hayden. We have seen it all here tonight. A tournament to crown a new number one contender. We have seen Eva Lise and Kiera Hogan battle all the way to the stage and beyond. Queen Charmel had to come out here and declare there will be a rematch between the two of them at Ladies Night Out 3 inside a steel cage. It's going to take 15 feet of steel to keep those two women inside the ring. And now the Diamonds title up for grabs. Oh! oh! Bit of a body avalanche in the corner there from Hai Young. And now look at that, taking that knee pad down. As you often say, Brad Gilmore, she has some educated feet. Here we go. Missed the mark right Roll there. Up. Roll up for the challenger. 
Kick out at one. Hi, oh. on. It's one thing to win the title, it's another to defend it. And there's a running knee. That flying knee right there, cover to retain. Two. I talk a lot about when you win a championship, you get a new level of confidence. You get a championship confidence. But you have to be very careful that you don't let that championship confidence turn into championship cockiness. And if you get to that level, you might not be prepared for the challenge at hand. Ty Young right now, in my opinion, is toting that line between confidence and cockiness. And that comes as no surprise to anyone who's followed her career. That's been the story <laughs> the whole time. I mean, right if Hi Young, Young is nothing else, Brad Gilmore, she's consistent. She is consistent. That is a good word for it. Oh! And right now she's consistently running Barbie Hayden into turnbuckle after turnbuckle. Well, Barbie Hayden, in only her second appearance here in a reality of wrestling ring, is being introduced up close and personal to every steel post and turnbuckle Hi Young can get her face into. Oh! It's like a family reunion with foreign objects. Cover here once again, Whoa. hooks the leg to retain the Diamonds title. Barbie Hayden doesn't even slip out the back door. She just creaks it open and gets that arm up. She is running out of gas, is the challenger. And now High Young drives that knee. In the small of the back, oh my goodness. Well, Barbie looks like she just might be running out of air, oxygen, gas, however you want to say Barbie it. Barbie Hayden looks like she's going to need a chiropractor if this doesn't stop. Right, you are. Either a chiropractor or a good lawyer. Well, I know one for that. You got to call Walker, Texas lawyer. Boot to the face right there. Oh. With High Young rolling through. Wait a minute. Oh, well, High Young trying to telegraph it. Barbie Hayden responds. A knee of her own to the face of the champion. And perhaps the tables have oh. turned here. Irish whip. Reversal again from the challenger. Trying to mount some kind of a comeback here. Oh! That frustration getting the better of the champion. Oh. Barbie Hayden. Knee in the corner. A remarkable turn of events here from the challenger who looked like she was out of it just moments ago. Head scissor takeover. Barbie Hayden. Fisherman suplex. Did she hold on for the pin? Cover. One, two. Oh. A kick out from the champion at the last moment. Hi Young looks seriously hurt here. Hooks the leg again and another kick out. We have got a battle on our hands here, folks. One for the ages for the Diamonds title. Oh. What would it mean for Barbie Hayden to finally... Oh, wait a minute. Hi Young. Matt Topolsky, not out of, I don't even think it was out of instinct or muscle memory, it was out of pure exhaustion. She falls down right as Barbie Hayden's charging into the turnbuckle, and both these women are out of it. I mean, it looks like, it, it looks like a war zone in there, Brad. These two have beaten the hell out of each other for this Diamond Division Championship. Ha ah, Young back to her feet somehow, some way. Trying to jump on the challenger here. One, Quick pin attempt. Two. This is a smart move on the part of the champion, but a kick out from Barbie Hayden once again. Ha ah, Young, look, Matt Topolsky, that's what I'm talking about. She's letting that frustration get into her. She's aggravated. She wants to put Barbie Hayden away, but she just can't seem to do it. She cannot allow herself to go to this place. This has cost her matches in the past. And look, Barbie Hayden 
now going for an R bar. Oh, Barry Hayden right there trying to channel a little Rex Andrews, perhaps. R bar center of the ring to win the Diamond Division Championship. High Young is a long way away from those ropes. Looks like High Young's about to tap. I think we're about to crown a new champion. Either a new champion or High Young's gonna have to go to the hospital. That arm has to be separated. The tendons of the shoulder went. Oh, roll up here, roll up here from High Young. And Barbie Hayden had to break the hold that almost took her to the promised land in order for this match to continue. Uh -oh. Oh, Barbie Hayden here, this is a signature of hers, that top rope DDT. Wait a minute. Reversal from High Young. Gonna go for that DDT again. High Young with that big forearm to the face. Oh, look at this! Oh! She it's eyes it, she buys it, and she tries it! Cover here to retain the Diamonds title! High Young is the winner! She did the very thing she needed to do, come out on the same stage that she won the title on and defend it. High Young still the Diamonds Division Champion. And unless, and of course the card is always subject to change, but as long as High Young remains the Diamonds Division Champion between now and Ladies Night Out 3, the table is set. Jordan Grace will face High Young for that Diamonds title in the next installment of this all women's invitational special right here on Title Match Network.